Thanks so much for joining us for another episode of Adoptable Pet Pals. I'm Kristen Diaz here with Maura Davies from the SBCA of Texas. Maura, I love visiting you because you just always have the best, cutest little animals looking for forever homes. And I know we have the best uh, homes available through our KROD and Odyssey team here in Dallas. <laughs> Who do we have today? Oh my goodness, I agree. And this, these two cuties, um, they're only a few weeks old. So these guys are actually still in foster. Um, you know, we're, we're just talking about what their names could be. Yeah, um, <laughs> they're but baby babies. They're baby babies. They're a litter of four. So this time of year, as you can imagine, it's kitten season. We get so many kittens. It's also puppy season. We get a lot of puppies. <laughs> so right now, actually, what we are looking for, for with, with help from the public is um, help fostering kittens. We have a big need for fostering kittens and also uh, for supplies to help our kitten fosters. Because when you become a foster for the SPCA of Texas, we provide all the supplies. Amazing. You just provide the love. So uh, food, whether it's kitten food or the formula, heating pads, scales. Then when, they're, when they reach about two pounds, they come back to the shelter. They'll be spayed or neutered and then ready for adoption. So that's a good thing. So yeah, fostering is so important. If you would like to help foster at the SPCA of Texas, you can check out our website, spca.org. There's a button right there where you can become a foster, Aww. sign up, get trained, take one of these cute little litters home and help get these guys uh, raised up enough to uh, get spayed or neutered and into their new homes. And also puppies, we have a lot of puppies right now. Um, we have several that are coming up for adoption soon. So adoption is uh, gonna be a big thing. So thank you for helping us. Um, also on the other end of that spectrum, it's important to spay and neuter your pets Absolutely. so that we have fewer of these babies inundating shelters across the country this time of year. So spaying and neutering is important. SPCA of Texas offers low cost spay and neuter. Um, we also do a couple other things. We treat, uh, not only do we test for heartworm, we can treat for heartworm now that's brand new. Wow. And we have payment plans for people. So this wow. is all low cost and pretty amazing. So SPCA of Texas has a ton of great programs. Um, we include also really one really quickly one last one. Sure. We also work to keep pets in homes through our Russell H. Perry, uh, uh, no, it's it's our um, uh, pet resource center. Oh, so yes. we are able to help keep pets in homes, and that is through providing food for wow. people who just need a little help, oh, gosh, uh, medical treatment for pets, even pet rent deposits as possible if is possible. So we're here to help animals at all ends of the, the you know their lives and their people who love them to make life better for animals, uh, whether it's through fostering, adopting, clinic services, um, and just keeping pets in homes, they're all so important. So thank you for supporting, um, just thank you everyone out there supporting all the wonderful work we do. Absolutely, we have some incredible people out there and I've personally fostered a cat and a dog before in the past and uh, let me tell you, it is just so rewarding, especially when we have animals that we feature here and we know that they've previously been fostered. It just helps socialize them, gets them in a routine, uh, and it's just, it's great for their upbringing, their character, their safety and security as well. Take a look at the information on your screen. Get in contact with the SBCA of Texas today.